Welcome back to Hot Money. On to a breaking story at the moment from what we understand is that the SEBI has banned Anil Ambani and 24 other entities from the securities markets for the next five years. We have with us my colleague Sajit Mangat, who is going to firstly tell us about the findings. Sajit, over to you. Uh, that's right. Uh, you know, in a uh, conclusion of the investigation into Reliance Home Finance, uh, the market regulator, uh, Securities and Exchange Bond of India, uh, has come out with the final order, which has barred Anil Ambani and 27 other entities, which is the group entities, along with individuals, uh, from accessing capital markets for the next five years. Uh, Anil Ambani, who is also chairman of uh, Anil uh, uh, Dhirubhai Ambani Group, uh, has also been barred from being on the the board or being any key managerial person of any listed or associates or subsidiaries of any listed companies for the next five years as well. Uh, the entire bar is based on the investigation undertaken by SEBI uh, after complaints uh, on uh, in a siphoning of funds where uh, you know uh, which went to the market regulator and the market regulator initiated uh, an investigation which include uh, included uh, looking at the forensic audits which were done in in Reliance Home Finance and Reliance Capital uh, by uh, other agencies like the PwC and the Grand Thornton. Uh, as per uh, the SEBI order, uh, what uh, the regulator has found is that Anil Ambani was a mastermind of fraudulent scheme uh, which uh, led to uh, you know, disposal of funds from Reliance Home Finance to various entities. In many cases, these entities were not eligible to get even loans because of uh, low cash flows or lower net worth criteria. Uh, roughly around 8,800 crores of this loan was uh, you know, diverted to group companies and related entities there. Uh, this entire uh, fraud was orchestrated by Anil Ambani along with key managerial person of uh, uh, Reliance Home Finance. In and in a couple of cases, uh, the regulator found that even though there was a board decision not to lend further to many of the entities related to the group, uh, this was overlooked and bypassed uh, by orders of Anil Lambani, who was chairman of the entire group there. Uh, this is uh, also, uh, it also brings into four, uh, you know, the fact that uh, Reliance Home Finance uh, went through a bankruptcy process and uh, at the end of that, it was uh, sold to another entity, which is there. As a result of the entire investigation and the order, uh, the there's a bar of five years for, for Anil Lambani and others, uh, for five for five years in the capital market and another five years uh, for uh, being on the board or on the uh, on any of the companies which are listed in in uh, and under the regulation of uh, SEBI there. There he's also been fined nearly 25 crores uh, as uh, as a penalty. Of course, uh, he there is. Uh, uh, a provision for him to go and appeal against the order at the Securities Appellate Tribunal.